Is this what you think of when someone says allergy? Well, watery eyes, runny nose, sneezing, wheezing, or itchy skin are often symptoms of allergies. But did you know that an allergic reaction actually involves your immune system? That's right. Your immune system protects you from potentially harmful substances in the things you eat, breathe, or touch. But the immune system of someone with allergies sees certain substances, which are harmless to most people, as things to react to, and this triggers an allergic response. These substances can be things like pollen, dust, mold, animal dander, even certain foods, and they are called allergens. While it's not clear why some substances trigger allergies and others don't, or why some people develop allergies and others don't, we do know that people who are predisposed to allergies produce excess IgE antibodies. When an allergic person comes in contact with an allergen, it can combine with a specific IgE antibody which causes histamines, leukotrienes, and other chemicals to be released from cells in the body tissues. This is what causes allergy reactions like sneezing, itching, swelling of tissues in the nose and airways, coughing, wheezing, and other symptoms. Each type of IgE reacts with only one type of allergen. That's why some people are only allergic to cat dander, while others are allergic to many things. Here's a list of conditions that may occur in allergy-prone families. Although not always allergic, they are grouped under the general label of atopic conditions. You probably know it as hay fever, but approximately 50 million Americans suffer from what we call allergic rhinitis. Sneezing, congestion, itching, and dripping of the nose are common symptoms. Allergic conjunctivitis, including symptoms of itchy, watery eyes, may also occur. Sinusitis is an inflammation of the hollow cavities in the skull around the eyes and behind the nose. Asthma is an atopic disease as well, and 20 million Americans suffer from the coughing, chest tightness, shortness of breath, and wheezing that it triggers. Eczema, or atopic dermatitis, is a skin condition that is often seen in infants but can occur later in life as well. Hives are itchy bumps on the skin, which vary in size and often come and go over days to months. Anaphylaxis is a severe allergic reaction, generally caused by foods, medications, or insect stings, and can also be caused by latex or other substances.